Hello everyone, for today I'm going to show you how you can easily install Procspace environment to your machine. To work with Git repos you should to have last version of Git, so you need just to install it. Ok, go ahead. Okay, after install, we are going to point number one to download our environment. Just doing copy paste a link into browser. Then you need press clone or download, download zip. After obtaining your zip file, you should to extract it into disk C. You can follow my patch or use yours as you wish. After extraction, we can see in our folder two files needed for us. This is runme and runme64. In my case, I should use runme64 because it directly depends from my operation system. It's 64, so in your case you can use runme uh, equals for 32, okay? Now you have to close your window and should run it again. Into PM3 folder we need to put our Proxmark source as subfolder. So we will do this by git. That's why we have already installed it. Ok, just copy a link from second point and put it into browser. Then press clone or download, then press this button to copy a git link. You have just write in your open it console git clone and uh, doing paste your link, press enter. After this, download of source code will be started immediately. As you see, we got our source files to compile. Now time for setup in a driver. Ok, so you should to go uh, to device manager and uh, your number of port of your device. I'll connect it to USB. At this moment very important to remember your COM number. So in my case it's number 3. That's number we will use a little bit later. Just do an updated driver.
Okay, downloading of our environment has ended. Just close the window. Then we need to uh, go to MC2 folder and find inside some of after build script. Open it for editing. Just follow my changes. If you have a RDV4 model, you no need to change and make lines. In my situation, I use not RDV4 model, so I should to change the building platform, changing line 30 and 31 for me is needed. The guy who made this script a little bit mess up a few moments, so we need to repair. Let's fix it. Okay, then save and close. Just run after build, our first build. Do not afraid, and the first start will be a little bit longer.
after compilation you can find subfolder builds in the MCS2 folder where the two platforms 32 and 64 as I already told you my platform is 64 so I should use it just doing extraction Check connection of your device and edit some files. That's why we be needed to know our COM port number. As you know, in my case, it's number three. Let's change it in all cases and save. Let's do in device flashing of our fresh firmware. Doing the same for go file. And uh, here you go. Go fast check our antenna signal. So my half cycle is okay. Like my video if your cycle is okay too.